much all day. How was the game plan going in? How'd you feel about what you guys were able to accomplish? Uh, just to get to him, uh, oppose our will uh, as a front, and uh, just continue to put him under pressure and under the rest. And uh, we was able to do that. We wasn't able to get him on the ground. Uh, but uh, we was able to get in the backfield uh, and kind of boogie yoogie him and, uh, so he can uh, have some air throws. So uh, that was really what we tried to do. Matthew, what does it mean just to come in here, and it wasn't pretty, but to get out of here with a victory, big NFC East win? Uh, you don't think it's pretty? Well, it's, any win is pretty tough. Uh, we just trying to get in a win column, and we want to uh, – we want to win. Any game we play, we want to win. And so, like I'll say, if we got to win 2-0 or we got to win 66 to 61. Uh, we don't care as long as we get the win. We uh, we are uh, graded on film and uh, we uh, make corrections. But uh, I think any win is a good win. It was a bounce back performance from your defense. Has you guys, have you guys found an identity? Would you say? Uh. We found an identity, but we can't keep letting that monster creep in. We have good games, and then we have some bad games. And so today was a good game, and that's what that's the defense we want to put out there. We got to uh, tighten up on them explosive plays. They had a couple of explosive plays, and every time they had explosive plays, that's when they scored. Uh, so we got to tighten up on that. But uh, yeah, I think y'all seen a tail of two halves uh, in the wins. We uh, our defense went out there. And we played dominant, and we played solid. And then on the losses, uh, it looked like we didn't know what he was doing. I'm nice to see Devin continue to do what he does. Come Who? A couple of Devin McCourty. Oh, man, uh, it's good, man. We uh, love Dev. Uh, he, he's the ultimate leader, but he's the ultimate team guy. You'll see him uh, on anybody else's picks or anybody else plays, excited. And uh, he's just happy to get off the field. So when they come to him uh, like, like they did today, uh, we're all excited for him, and uh, we all we all celebrate with him. And uh, I don't think they have ever any rubbed anybody ever wrong. So uh, we all excited for death. Matthew, is that uh, Bill Belichick um, breaking a tie with George Hallis in second place all time? Mm -hmm. Was that something you you know was addressed in the locker room? And, and what is your reaction to? Yeah, I'm not telling you nothing about the locker room, but uh, <laughs> we're uh, very proud of our coach. Uh, he he tells his players we in games, but uh, he won all those games. He, uh, he he game plan. He did the film. He did the preparation. He did the study, and uh, he put his players in uh, positions to make plays. And so, uh, with uh, him being all, uh, second all time, uh, that's just a compliment to him as a coach, uh, the longevity that he's had, and just the uh, success that he's had. But also, like he said, man. We uh we came out here and did it. So uh, the players as well. And before you go, was that boogie oogie? Did I hear that? Uh, yeah yeah yeah. You got to put some boogie oogie oogie on him. He throw force air throws, man. So uh, that's what we were trying to do. Uh, you can't get him to the ground. Get a hand up, uh, hand in his face, uh, and try to make him just uh, throw it out of bounds or uh, air throw off the mark. Thank Appreciate y'all.